not a single even remotely close attempt at first blood. Going to be a little bit of action here at the Rune. Highlight died, level three. We'll go ahead and throw in a knife, but Universe will find himself a rune. However, could be in trouble now. We're going to see Arteezy use his ulti. There's a crit swarm that caught two. Phaeton has to head to the high ground. He's going to end up dying, though. In the meantime, look who made it out. Universe making it out with a very quick TP. We're back underway, and... Envy and Pylai die. Got to continue to rain. Ortiz will come clear this lane up for him. He's staying right on it. He's not even remotely worried about that. Yeah, he's going to get this kill. One auto attack. And like you said, Witchcraft. Glyph has been deployed. As C9 wants to defend bottom now. We're going to see a cast on out on AUI. Fears there with the follow-up flat. Doesn't even need to split. Envy isn't in there or going to be heading in there. Universe may take a shot here, and he will. Connects on the fake tie in mid under his own tier one. Artiz, he's there, doesn't have his ulti for a while, but they're not going to need it. Reaction wasn't coming. Thought we might see one or two TPs in. Doesn't matter. Radiance bottom tower is under attack. Radiant structures are fortified. It's going to be a cast. It's kind of getting spread out, and Artiz, playing very deep. Might be able to get him with a Crypt Swarm. Uh, nope. Went the wrong way. Now he's going to be caught from behind with a fire blast out on his own. Here comes the rest of his team uh, trying to come in from the back. There's going to be a nice ulti from Zai. Arteezy still alive, but losing all of his damage to Fata. He's going to be cleaned up with one last right click, and now Zai, heroic as it was, the effort goes fruitless. Nothing faster. Gale on the bone seven from PPD, but... Pretty much just desperation. He's, he's going to be right clicked down after getting a haste room. Universe comes back up. Cog's got him. Knocked him out of it. And he's going to run on into the Roche pit. But the birds are now on to him. There's going to be a sprout. And here comes Pylite Die around the back as well. Blade mail or not. A roll of the dice. Gets him a lot of damage. And they're going to end up losing Universe. Fears there with a return kill onto the Prophet though. And he will go ahead and use his split finally. AUI down to about half health. Does he have any help on the way? Doesn't appear so. As he's just going to end up dead. I, yeah, certainly not now. Well, no. Here comes another TP. I don't think they're going to be able to save the tower. It's going to be close. Yeah, they're worried about this. Zai's going to be spotted up on the high ground. And he's going to be right click down very easily. So that's one down immediately. Fear in the meantime at half health has to just continue to run. Back here in mid. You can see there's going to be a nice spell on RTZ trying to TP out. Uh, not going to make it. Damage too high. Universe next to be picked off. And this has been a whole lot of one by one from EG and C9. Capitalizing on it to the tune of a double kill. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. Split on mid. Phaethon hooked up to the Earth Spirit. And Fear looking for nothing. We're going to see Phaethon come back down. He's set up on the high ground, but here comes Envy and the Wolves. And Phaethon could be in trouble, but the damage off from Envy, yeah, they're just going to get Fear. Fear's got to blink quick. Nope, doesn't matter. Lost his blink. Immediately, they're going to turn back around. There are the Visage Familiars, and AUI's right on his tail. Very ineffective split, and Cloud9 is just taking... <laughs> oh, Bowen 7. Oh, there's going to be Universe coming in, but Bowen 7 was tossed in the air. Now he's caught and just being melted down by the Familiars. He's going to end up dead to that. Artisi has come in, though. We'll get a return kill. No, Universe actually did manage to survive. He did manage to outrun the birds at some point, and now Arteezy, though, caught by those birds. Fear's gonna come in, hits a nice three-man clap, but can he do the work on his own? Yeah, that's the thing, he has no support. And yeah, that's some um, a dead panda, and a fed gem, and a GG! As EG opened this game up, building a lead, and it was snatched away, and never even thought about giving back by C9. Wonderful play from them here in game one. And that's got to be really disheartening. I mean, I feel like, again, I feel like their draft had a few things going for it. But the, in terms of the mileage you have to get from those big ultimates, especially Panda, just not there for EG whatsoever.